All right, today with the latest update to iOS 11 on the iPad, you can now screencast your iPad screen without audio, um, doing some really, really simple, cool things. It's, it's not hard at all. What you're gonna do is choose settings. And in settings, you're going to choose control panel. And there's only one choice in there, customize controls, choose that. And you'll notice that on the top, I've got the things included in my control center. And on the bottom where all the pluses are, I've got things that I can add to control center. Screen recording is one of those things that I can add to control center. So it's really easy to move things around. If I'd like to choose alarm, I hit the plus. If I wanna remove alarm, I hit the minus. Or if I have Apple TV, I hit the plus to add the Apple TV remote. And that's all there is to it. To kind of customize what you want in your control setting. Now, to screencast, uh, you can go to your home screen or you can just swipe up from the bottom of your iPad and there is the little blinking red circle in the corner and that's what you can use to screencast your iPad. To add audio to your screencast, combine the recording you just took of your iPad screen and put it into iMovie. And when you do that, you can then narrate what you've done um, with your iPad screen to kind of explain what's going on. So how, how can you do all this? Well, choose to create a movie in iMovie. And then right there today, you can see that I've selected the most recent movie video, which is what was picked up from the screencast that I did on my iPad. And then hit the microphone to start recording. You can narrate. Um, you can explain, you can talk about whatever it is that you need to talk about. And then when you're done, you just hit the stop recording button and now you've narrated your movie and you're ready to upload it to wherever it is that your students need to go to see it.